Hello friends, in this problem you have been given three questions and then you have to find value of a given expression. The three questions are the first is a plus 1 times b plus 1 times c plus 1 this is equals to 3. The second equation is a plus 2 times b plus 2 times c plus 2 this is equals to minus 2. And the third equation is a plus 3 times b plus 3 times c plus 3 this is equals to minus 1. Then you have to find the value of a plus 20 times b plus 20 times c plus 20. Let us say this equation is equation 1 and this is equation 2 and this is my equation 3. Now we will make some substitutions to solve this problem. So let us say a plus 1 this is equals to x b plus 1 this is equals to y and c plus 1 c plus 1 this is equals to z. So with this substitution the first equation will be x times y times z this is equals to 3. Let's call this as equation 4. Now we can rewrite second equation. So this is nothing but x plus 1 times y plus 1 and this times z plus 1 this is equals to minus 2. Now we can multiply these three terms. So we have three terms. We can multiply these three terms and we can expand. Basically there is a result that we can use to expand such kind of terms and that result is if you have something like this x plus k times y plus k times z plus k this can be expanded to x by z plus k times x by plus y z plus x z plus k square so let me shift little bit so this will be k square times x plus y plus z and then plus k q so this can be written something like this so this is an important result in this case k is a constant and for this case k is equals to 1 so if you see in this case k is equals to 1 so this is basically k so with this result i can expand this this will be x by z plus k times k is 1 1 times x by e plus by z plus x z plus k square k square is again 1 this is x plus y plus z and k q is also 1 and this is equals to minus 2. So I can write x y z from equation 4 is equals to 3. So 3 plus x by y z plus x z plus x plus y plus z plus 1 this is equals to minus 2. So you have 3 plus 1 4 and if you take this to right hand side I will have x by e plus y z plus x z plus x plus y plus z this is equals to minus 6. Let us call this equation as equation number 5. Now let us consider the third equation that is a plus 3 times b plus 3 times c plus 3 and this is equals to minus 1. Once again I can use this result for expansion. So you will have basically I have to first convert into x and y and z. So this will be x plus 2 times this will be y plus 2 and this will be z plus 2 this is equals to minus 1. So let me expand or I can take this somewhere here. So let us copy this and then I can paste. Let us move it here. So what we have? We have x by z plus k. So this will be if I expand this 
first term will be x by z plus k times x by plus y z plus x z but k is equals to 2 in this case and next is k square that is 2 square which is equals to 4 times you see this is k square times x plus y plus z so this is x plus y plus z plus k q that is 2 q that is, that is 8 is equals to minus 1 and x y z is equals to 3 we have already shown you see this x y z is equals to 3 so we can plug this value here so this is 3 plus 2 times x by y z plus x z and this is 4 times x plus y plus z plus 8 is equals to minus 1. So this is 3 plus 8 that is 11. So if that goes to the right hand side this will become minus 12. And this side I will have 2 times x by plus y z plus x z plus 4 times x plus y plus z and this is equals to minus 12. So now I can divide by 2 both sides. So this will be x y plus y z plus x z plus 2 times x plus y plus z and this is equals to minus 6. Now we already have one result that is this one x by plus y z plus x z plus x plus y plus z is equals to minus 6. So let us use this result. So we will have minus 6 plus here you have 2 times x plus y plus z. So 1 will be used and 1 will be left. So this is equals to minus 6. This means now I have x plus y plus z this is equals to 0. So this is equation 6. Now from equation 5 if I plug this value that is x plus y plus z is equals to 0. So from 5 I can say that x y plus y z plus x z and x plus y plus z is 0 this is equals to minus 6. So now I have another result x by plus y z plus x z and this is equals to minus 6. Now in this problem we have to find the value of a plus 20 times b plus 20 plus c times c plus 20. We have to find what is the value of this expression. Now let us expand. So a plus 20 I can write x plus 19 times y plus 19 times z plus 19 and now if I expand using the same formula the first term is x by z times k k in this case is 19 times x by plus by z plus x z plus k square times k square is 19 square x plus y plus z and finally you will have kq that is 19q and now we know the values you see x y z is basically minus 3 if you remember this was the equation not minus 3 plus 3 so this equation 4 x y z is equals to 3 so here I can plug this value and 19 times this value x by y by z x z we just found this value this is equals to minus 6 and this is 19 a square and x plus y plus z this value is equals to 0 and plus 19 q. So what is the value? So this is 3 minus 19 times 6 plus 0 plus 19 q. So this is 3 minus 114 plus 6859. So this is equals to 6862 minus 114 and this is equals to 6748. So this is the value of given expression. 
that is a plus 20 plus uh, times b plus 20 plus c plus 20 so this is equals to 6 7 4 8 so this is the answer for this problem i hope this video was useful for you and if it is useful for you please share with your friends like this video and subscribe my channel thanks for watching this video and i will see you in the next video thank you